Even if you haven't heard of Marissa Meyer, you know her work. At Google, she helped revolutionize the web and the way we use it every day. Well, now Meyer is hoping to do the same at Yahoo as its chief executive, starting with a new initiative she is unveiling here on Today. Marissa, good morning. Good morning. Good to see you. Let's, I want to see what this new design is of the homepage in a moment, but let's start talking about the company. You came on back in the summer with a big job, high expectations, and really the mission was to turn around Yahoo. What is the strategy in a nutshell? Well, I think that we're really focused on the world's daily habits and making them more inspiring and entertaining. And so that means taking the things that Yahoo's always been great at, the homepage, search, mail, news, finance, sports. There's so many great franchises. Really allowing them to refresh, be more modern, and also capitalizing on the trend towards mobile. It's difficult because this is a highly competitive environment. I don't have to tell you. And if you read the trade press about Yahoo, you inevitably run across words like struggling, beleaguered, or Silicon Valley's favorite wounded duck was one I read yesterday. What's been the biggest challenge for you so far? Uh, I really think of it in terms of opportunities. And I just think that I've had a ton of fun coming into the company. There's a lot of great people there. There's great ideas. And our users have been incredibly loyal. Uh, we ha still have 700 million users a month on the website, 200 million users on mobile each month. And really delivering to them terrific experiences is something that we're really focused on. Obviously, talent is incredibly crucial. You've already done a couple popular things since coming on. You give free food at the cafeteria, smartphones right. for every employee. <laughs> is it hard, though, to compete for talent when you're going up against the biggies like a Google or a Facebook or an Apple? Well, I think what really inspires people is the ability to make an impact. And there's a great opportunity to impact a lot of users, impact Yahoo as a company for the positive. And that's something that's really inspired a lot of terrific people to sign on. You are the youngest CEO of a Fortune 500 company in America. Is that a help? Is it a hindrance? Do you find it to be totally irrelevant to what you're trying to do every day? I just spend a lot of time thinking about it. I spend a lot of more time thinking about our users and what we need to do in order to really delight them. Well, a lot of people, of course, know that you took on this big job of being CEO of Yahoo, but you had another big job, which is, of course, having a, a little baby who just was born in September. How's he doing? He's great. Four and a half months old. And, you know, you took a short maternity leave, just a couple of weeks. Was that hard to pull off in retrospect to juggle all those things? Most people don't have to run a company at the same time. Well, I've been a mom now for about four and a half months, and I've been CEO for seven months. And I would say that I wouldn't have missed a minute of either experience. They've both been great. It does take a lot of focus. You need to make sure that you're really prioritizing that. There's not a lot of room for anything else. <laughs> yeah. um, but, you know, overall, I've been having a terrific time with both being a mother and being a CEO. Have you been surprised the degree to which this high-profile gig comes with attention on everything you do? I mean, people looking at you as a role model as well or looking at you as an example. Has that been difficult to deal with? Again, I haven't just spent a lot of time looking at it or even thinking about it. I've really been focused on the products, what we need to do. And there's so many great people at Yahoo, and there's so many great users that we want to serve well that I really put my energy there. Okay, we are going to demonstrate this new product. But all right, we're going to do a little show and tell. Sure. Now, it looks different, but not so different that I don't recognize it. Well, we wanted it to be familiar, but we also wanted it to embrace some of the modern paradigms of the web. So, What are the biggest changes you want to show Well, one, us? we have these nice big bold images here. The ability to actually quickly go through all kinds of different editorial content up here on the top. But then we also have one of the things I really like, which is this very personalized news feed down below. It's infinite, so you can just keep scrolling forever. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it goes on forever and basically, yeah, all right. And the unending news feed. And it's personalized to you. So, for example, obviously, I like Yahoo, so do a lot of my friends. So you can see here, this is an article about the fact that we just had this launch this morning. And, some of my, and you can actually see uh, that my friends like Yahoo. So what you've clicked on will go to the top of your news feed, in a sense. Well, what you've clicked on, what your friends have liked, what your friends have read, are all things that would appear in here. And you can actually switch to, say, see local news, entertainment news. And then you can also see over here on the right-hand side all kinds of the information people come to Yahoo every day for. 
weather, quotes, sports scores. So these are some of these utilities. Mm -hmm. It sounds to me the big innovation is it's more personalized. That's right. It's more personalized and it's more dynamic. People said, give me a reason to come back to Yahoo a few times a day. And now the content's always updating and refreshing. And it gives you all the information you want. And a few things that are a nice serendipitous surprise. Okay, great. Well, people can get, get on it right now. If you go to yahoo.com, it's rolling out this morning. That's right. All right, Marissa Meyer, thank you so much. It's great to have you here. If you want to see the new Yahoo experience for yourself, you can also head to today. Dot com.